You have six seconds to make an impression with your resume. Don't waste it. I'm Nicole from LowIncomeRelief.com. We help millions of people save money and get free stuff. Discover all the ways we can help you at LowIncomeRelief.com. It's bizarre, but it's true. Many employers who require resumes don't actually read them. According to Glassdoor, the average recruiter or hiring manager spends six seconds reading a resume. In six seconds, it's not going to be the details that keep your resume out of the rejection pile. The recruiter doesn't have time to analyze your high school accolades, your perfect qualifications, or your detailed job history. It matters, and you should include it, but don't count on those details to save the day. The visual appeal of your resume is critical. It's a make it or break it factor for your success. You absolutely need to have an organized, well-formatted, visually appealing resume. It should be unique and easy to scan. Does that sound overwhelming? It doesn't have to be. We've found some solid tips that can help you make a beautiful, impressive, ready-to-win resume in mere minutes. So, before we begin, what is the point of a resume? A resume should be a brief overview of your education, qualifications, and experience. It's a short paper that focuses on your skills and what you can do for the company. Some people, especially those located outside the United States, call this kind of document a curriculum vitae. These are essentially the same sort of document, although CVs tend to focus more on your credentials and accomplishments in the past. CVs also tend to be longer than resumes. Both a resume and a CV can benefit from these five essential resume tips. Tip number one, use a template. Of course, we could reinvent the wheel and design a resume entirely by ourselves, but it's much easier to use an existing template. I like to use Canva, which has a ton of resumes you can use. They are conveniently divided into categories, including simple, modern, minimalist, professional, creative, and more. Be careful though, because not all of Canva's templates are suitable for resumes, even if they claim to be resume templates. You have to be very careful with which one you select. As you browse for the perfect template, be sure to remember these other resume tips. Tip number two, be careful with color. Color can kill your resume. Never use a colored background because it is too distracting and it can make it difficult to scan your resume quickly. The same is true of brightly colored text. Make sure that the background is white and the bulk of the text is either black or dark blue. If you choose to add color, use one color as an accent and use it sparingly. Tip 3. Be generous with white space. Resist the urge to fill up all the blank space. Don't squeeze sections closer together or right into the margins. White space is critically important. It increases the visual appeal and it makes it easier to scan the document quickly. Tip 4. Protect yourself from discrimination. There are some things you should never include on your resume, even if it's trendy or popular to do so. These include things like photos and physical addresses. Never include a photo, even if you find a template that has space for one. Similarly, if you include your physical address, you may be judged just by the neighborhood you live in. It's better to leave this information out. Tip 5. Always save your resume as a PDF. Even a perfectly formatted resume can look atrocious if it's opened in the wrong program. You can make sure your resume always looks sharp by saving it as a PDF. And remember, your resume should use only one page. You can find 16 additional resume tips on our website at lowincomerelief.com. We also have some great tips about job interviews and a helpful list of the 12 best job search sites. Thanks for watching. I hope this video was helpful to you. Please subscribe to our channel and share this video. We appreciate your support.